All right, y'all, welcome back to Philly D's Garage. Today, let me show y'all what we're gonna do today. Today, we got the GS. I just wanna show y'all how I'm gonna clean off all this dirt and tree sap and tree shit from off my Buick. Um, There's really nothing I can do about this because I got trees all over my yard. Um. All my cars get this shit on it. Uh, so I'm just gonna show y'all how I'm gonna get it off. Um, let me show y'all what I'm gonna use. Um, use my turbo jet. You just hook this right up to your water hose. Um, it's not it's not as good as a pressure washer, but I don't feel like uh, turning on a pressure washer right now. So just want something a little quieter. So let me get y'all set up real quick. Not gonna be a long video. Um, just wanna get y'all, uh, show y'all what I do real quick. So how you do it. Hook this up to your I'm gonna show y'all what it looks like. turned the water on so water's turned on make sure it's tight all right so i turn it on like this this wall with a lot of people from uptown have died all right i'm gonna let the water flow out all right so that's one stream right there and then the other one comes with it comes with two jets so this jet and then this jet. So I can switch them. This is more like a wide pattern. And this one is more like a straight stream. Like I just showed you. So um, we're going to use the straight stream first. All right. So I'm going to show you all what I'm going to do. First off, let me show you all how, how like grimy this shit is. Like, I mean, it's on there. So I'm just gonna take some simple green. Simple green, power purple, same thing. Spread all this up. So if any of y'all live, you know, where there's a lot of trees and stuff like that, you might have to go through the same thing. I'm not gonna degrease my whole engine right now and all that, I'm just gonna spray up there i don't really have to cover this up because all this is weatherproof you know so as long as you just hit in the direction you're trying to hit this would be fine so spray a little bit of the uh, simple green on it power purple whatever you want to call it um, we're going to start with this one yeah, like I like using, I was gonna put my chest strap on, but I'm just gonna carry y'all real quick. Use one hand. Now I would've used my power uh, pressure washer, but I don't feel like it's kinda early. I don't wanna wake people up and shit, you know? So this valve is open. And then you open up this valve right here. Now anything that don't wanna come off or that's too stubborn, I'm just gonna take a rag and scrub it out, but I gotta get this stuff off. All right, so open up this valve. It's not as strong as a pressure washer, but. If you guys get wet, I'm, I'm sorry. Probably should have got the pressure washer. All 
I mean, it says turbo jet, but it ain't that much of a turbo. <laughs> All right, so. All right. All right. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to grab a rag. We're going to agitate some of that, uh, some of that dirt because... Around it's not coming off easy enough. Let them see some of Watching that Gilly the Kid. You know, these are all good brothers. Everybody we know raised up with. Uh, sister right here. Alright, that's uh. Let me see. Man, look at that. See that? See that dirt? See, pressure washer would have took this right off, but honestly, I didn't want to pull that out. Man, trees, like, you wonder how tree a tree can do all this. And I've pressure washed this car already. I've cleaned it. I've cleaned this car multiple times. It's just... When this car sits up under a tree or near any tree, this is what happens. This is what happens. I was like, you know what? Let me just show my guys, YouTubers, what I gotta do. What you guys see? Maybe you gotta do the same thing. Maybe you guys live up under trees. I don't know. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna spray that down again. With some more simple. With some more of this shit. I gotta remember, um, Your uh, cabin filter on this car is right here, right in there. So if all that's clogged up with leaves and debris, that's basically what you're gonna breathe in. So you wanna clean that up. All right, let's just spread that off one more time. All right, guys, so I'm going to switch this jet. This is how you switch the jet. All right, so take this jet off. It's real easy. Ugh. I think from the water pressure being on there, right, there you go. It got tighter. So you take this one off. Now you can... Switch it with this one. And rest in peace, rest in peace, Khalid. Khalid ain't no way. Khalid just got killed. Khalid ain't no way. He just got killed. Put this one on. It's a different jet. See it? That's just a hole. And this one is like a wide pattern. Let's just spray it off real quick, y'all. This one is a little different. As y'all can see, it's more of like a wide pattern. 
guys and there you go it's that simple i'm done i mean i'm not trying to make it look pretty but i just wanted to clean it up real quick because it only takes literally like two weeks like literally two weeks for that to happen to this car so i just do that real quick and i mean look at it now i mean i barely touched the car that looks 10 times better so um yeah man this thing worked yo Cool. This is like my little miniature pressure washer. They call it the Turbo Jet. I think I got this from actually I think I got this from Walmart. To be honest, but you can get it from uh you can get it from any store, Amazon, Walmart, wherever the case may be. Um, but yeah, man, if you guys got if you guys are in a yard where there's a bunch of trees and you know rodents and stuff like that and they just getting all types of stuff on your car the turbo jet is something that's definitely an alternative to like a pressure washer that could cost four five six seven into the thousands of dollars so this thing was like 25 bucks um so yeah man um yeah so i hope i hope you guys figure out how you can just clear up the tree uh the tree stuff from off your car if you live up in the trees um yeah man so if y'all like the video hit the like button subscribe uh check out the comments let me know what y'all think <laughs> and um catch y'all on the next one